the latest innovation, born in sight of the Safe Technologies Industrial Group, that is Continuous Thermal Decomposition Plant UTD2, has been successfully tested and commissioned. This unique equipment was manufactured for Gazprom Neft and installed at the Vingapurovska oil gas field at the drilling and oil sludge landfill site. During drilling operations, huge amounts of oil sludge and oil-contaminated soils are produced. By now, these wastes are stored at 4,500 cubic meters. By in less than one year, they will be utilized at the thermal decomposition plant too. During the very first week of operation, the plant reached its designed capacity and demonstrated almost double excess capacity due to high performance and simplicity of operation. By now, the plant converts up to one and a half ton of hydrocarbon waste per hour. The landfill covered its functionality and is capable of receiving drilling sludge and oil sludge again. The UTD2 plant operates on unique proprietary technology based on low-temperature pyrolysis principle, pyrolysis being the process of heating of the hydrocarbon waste in oxygen-deficient environment. In the process of pretreatment, the drilling waste is passed through vibra sieve, where the sludge is separated from stones, sticks, twigs, construction debris and mechanical impurities. The feedstock then is moved to reactor via screw conveyor. The plant starts up on boiler fuel or diesel oil, which is pumped to the dual fuel burner installed in the furnace. The pressure in the chamber is controlled by raw material feed and temperature rise rate. The beginning of process is signaled by temperature rise in the heat exchanger. After the process stabilizing, the main burning capacity is lowered. The derived pyrolysis gas is rerouted into the system to continue the heating. Viper and gas mix is cooled in the condensation system and then, having entered the separator, is divided by fractions. Pyrolysis liquid fuel is drained through the bottom nozzle to the receiver tank, from where it is directed to the storage tank. Dry residue is discharged by screw conveyor. Processing of hydrocarbon waste turns it into marketable products suitable for further usage. The quality of liquid fuel and dry residue is approved by numerous laboratory testing. During operation, the thermal decomposition plant consumes derived pyrolysis oil. Thus, the diesel fuel consumption is minimum, about 17 liters per ton of sludge. Dry residue is used for road and in construction, reclamation of industrial sites, quarries and landfills, which makes it a cost-effective solution, taking into account the remoteness of the most oil fields. The cutting-edge automatic control system monitors all the process parameters fully automatic operation mode is possible. The plant also can be controlled manually from the operator's control panel. The power consumption of the plant is 25 kW only. Due to the airtight process and absence of emissions, the environmental impact is negligible. The thermal decomposition plant is not just yet another innovation. This technological breakthrough has the multiple potential use it is capable of solving several problems at once, such as liquidation of sludge pits as it is required by law, and transition to pit-free drilling, recovering landfills contaminated by hydrocarbons, normalizing environmental situation on territories of oil-producing companies. Successful testing and commissioning of the continuous thermal decomposition plant demonstrated the highest quality and cutting-edge process designed for the equipment manufactured by Safe Technologies Industrial Group. Today this plant is unrivaled in Russia by its process and design concept.